Welcome back, everyone. Thanks for staying with us today. We have Miss Elmarie Carr Brooks again and Dr. Diana Outlaw, who's with Mississippi State University. Both of them are here to talk about a couple of upcoming summer camps going on in Starkville. Yes, we're real excited. Mm -hmm. uh, of course, at Emerson Family School, we have a, a respite program. And it's a child abuse prevention program. So mm -hmm. as families participate, uh, children participate in the camps that we have, I'll be working on parenting classes with the parents of those children. If they have children younger than mm -hmm. five years of age, then they can participate in the respite program. And that's, we have that program four days a week, 8 to 12, Monday through Thursday. And that's going on if the parents sign their kids up for either the upcoming biology camp or the cooking camp or lessons in the kitchen camp. Exactly. You were on or sunrise last week talking about that. But um, Dr. Outlaw is here to talk about biology camp coming up. So what all are the kids going to learn? Well, we usually introduce them uh, to birds in the, the uh, classroom so they can actually touch and feel these, these local birds, like we have an American robin. And these Blue are Jay. real. These are all real <laughs> birds, yes. And northern cardinal, very common around here. And kids that get to look up close to these things. Then we teach them how to use binoculars, take them outside to do some bird watching. Ah. And then this year, we're going to try something a little bit different, and we're going to have them make their own field guides that they can then take home and show to their families uh, what, what they've learned in, in our camp. And this camp, I'm sure, gets them really interested in science if they didn't know they were really interested in it before. Yeah, and that's the, really the best part is kids might come in and they might you know, hesitate a little bit, especially when they see these, these dead birds on the table. <laughs> and by the end, you know, they're, they're, their faces light up, they're excited, they're, they're interacting with their stu the other students, with us. It's, it's really a great experience for them and for us. And they'll be able to look for all these cool different kinds of birds when mm -hmm. they step outside, you know, that's something right. new they didn't really notice right. before. That's right. Something they see every day. And that's day. what we're trying to do. We want to expose the children, and they can even uh, educate the parents. Mm -hmm. And, of course, our focus are with the parents, and uh, what is a better way f to bring conversation in the family. Mm -hmm. Let's talk about the birds. Let's go out and bird watch together as a family. Mm -hmm. That's a family activity. Exactly, and it's definitely important for the kids to keep learning over the summer when, you know, most of them are taking a break from school. So when are both of these camps and how can they sign up? Uh, the first one, Kids in the Kitchen, starts next week, the 16th and the 17th. Mm -hmm. And then we have a, the biology camp is in July, the second week of July. is two days, two hours each day, 10 to 12. And then a second Kids in the Kitchen camp is uh, also in the second week of July. So they can just call Emerson Family School at 320-4607 and please sign up because right. space is kind of an issue sometimes. Right, lots to learn, and of course, it's free. Always a good thing. Yes. Always free. All right, thanks so much for coming on, ladies. Stay with us. We'll have more midday after the break. <laughs>